<laughs> oh. Hi friends, welcome back to this week's class, or not really class, it's just we're playing Outer Wilds this week. Thank you so much for those of you that actually told me that you wanted to see me play more of this. Because you left your comments, I'm getting to play more of it, so I cannot tell you enough how valuable those are to me. 10,000 thank yous to the people that had an opinion and actually spoke it. For those of you that didn't want to watch me play this and didn't say anything, haha, you didn't say anything, so you're stuck watching more. Or I guess you could always just turn off the video and go somewhere else, but I'm going to trust that you're not going to do that. So we're going to jump back into playing Outer Wilds. If it's been a little while since you watched the last one, I am in the Zero G cave. I don't totally know what's going on, but I'm supposed to fix a satellite while I'm down here. So let's just continue on figuring out what's going on here. I believe there's somebody I can talk to over here. So I'm going to go... Oh! Oh, do not... Do not upthrust unless you really want to go flying. Zero G. You know, maybe I could have figured that out. Let's talk to Tuff. Hi, Tuff. Hey, hey, nice of you to drop down. I'm getting some zero G time in. So you're going in there? In the cave? Huh. What? No, I'm fine. Great, great and fine. You don't look fine, Tuff. Well, you know I hate that cave, so I don't know why you're making me talk about it. Ugh, I could, now I've got hand sweats. Ooh, gross. Sorry, Tuff. Okay, so Tuff doesn't like the cave. There's a joke here about Tuff not being tough. We're not going to make that joke. That's That joke is beneath all of us. Okay. Make sure that we're not missing anything. Nope, that's tough. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Oh, don't screw that up. Okay. Cool. Great. That minimizes fall damage. Where's our next ledge? Not behind me. Oh, uh, let's just go off the edge. Yeah, how bad could it be? How bad could it be? How bad could it be? I did not hurt myself. I'm very pleased. My husband would be impressed. None of you should be impressed. That wasn't hard. Oh! Oh boy! This gets way darker and scarier. Okay, land your feet on it. Oh god. Oh, good lord. Oh, this is not good. Hold L to lock on. X. Oh, I... This is not great. Okay? In case it's not clear, I'm not actually standing on anything. I'm just floating, which I'm not doing a great job of. Oh, this is frightening. Okay? Match velocity. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Oh god. Oh, no. Oh, eat bad. Oh, I hit the wall. I hit the wall and I hurt myself. I... No, this is not... Oh, this is so embarrassing. Guys, I'm gonna cut this because me trying to figure out the velocity that I have to match is gonna be a nightmare. No, just, 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 just. Now what? Velocity matched. Great. How do I fix it? Hang on, you had me match the velocity and now you won't let me fix it? Oh, great. Okay. Just crash into it with your face? Good. Fine. Okay, great. Where's the last one of these little buggers? I hear it. I have directional headphones and I still can't tell what the stupid thing is. Alright, I'm not doing terrible on fuel, but I'm about to run into the damn wall. I can feel it. Where am I headed? Where am I going? Where the dingle dang it is the last damn thing? Hang on. I hear it. 
Oh, it is so hard to freaking navigate. Where am I going? Ow! Wall. Sorry, guys, I know this looks really stupid. I'm not trying to be colossally dumb. I'm just surprisingly good at it right now. Ow! Don't hit the wall. Don't hit the wall. I just... How do I go forward, for the love of God? Go towards the... There we go. I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. Is it in there? It's in there, isn't it? I have to give it give it I'm calm, I'm chill, I'm not god freaking ah! Just just stop bouncing off the wall, please. Is that where I'm trying to go? That's definitely where I'm trying to go. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. Get near the hole? Oh, there are no breaks. <laughs> Alright, let's roll. Let's... How do we roll? We roll like that. Ow! Ow! No. Please, no. Please, no. Please, no. 50% of fuel remaining. Ow! Point at it with my head and go! Yeah, no, yes, no, yes, 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 yes. <gasps> okay, I'm calm, I'm chill. Do not fall out the back of this. Oh, so holding the velocity actually doesn't matter all that much. Okay, that helps. <sighs> can I can I fix it now? Or are you just gonna let me get close to it? Cool! Velocity matched. You gonna let me fix it? Oh. Guys, that was that was mildly irritating. Any of the rest of you guys mildly irritated or just me? Okay. Ow. Ran into the wall one more time for good measure. Ooh. Ow. Ow. Double diddly dumb. Damn it. Pain. Pain. Down thrust. Stand on the ground for a second. Remember what gravity feels like and how pleasant it is. Okay. Let's try this up fuel again. Ow! 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 Great. You know what? We made it. We're good. We're fine. Whee! Yay! Return suit. I fixed a satellite. I know it looks stupid. I know it took a long time and it's dumb, but I'm very pleased. <laughs> I still really like this cave. I think it's really pretty. Oh, it just looks like stars. And then it stops looking like stars the exact moment I say that. Figures. Hey, you proud of me? Nicely done. Of course, it'll be a little more stressful when you're hurtling through space, but just remember your training and try not to hit anything big. Yeah. I can see you're itching to get off this rock, so go get the launch codes from the observatory and get out of here already. Already got them. Best of luck out there, and hey, try to avoid getting yourself killed now that I've put so much time into training you. Got it? Sounds good, Gossin. Doodles, let's go! Nicely done. Why do I have to talk to you again? I was... I'm leaving. Goodbye. Okay. I believe the observatory was this way. Sorry, I know everything's really loud. I'm trying to turn down those, uh... Those waterfalls. I know they're very loud. Was there something else? Yeah, where's the Nomai statue in the museum from? From Giant's Deep. Gabro fished it out of the oceans and brought it back here for study. Hornvelds doesn't know much about it yet. 
but that's just crazy old that it's just crazy old and super tough. I wonder why the Nomai carved it. Apparently, Gabriel went back to Giant's Deep to try to learn more about the statue. Maybe they'll find some answers there. Hmm. Where on Giant Deep would I find Gabro? Gabro said they were going back to Giant Deep to wherever they found that Nomai statue. One of the islands, I think. You remember Gabro plays the flute, right? Like, all the time? I bet your signal scope could find them easily. If you do see Gabro, say hi for me. Will do. Okay, apparently that's all I needed to learn from you, so let's go. <laughs> oh. With the little bit of flying practice I have, I'm, I'm worried I'm going to crash nice and hard wherever I'm going. Hopefully this game is forgiving of that. Mm, I don't feel the need to get on the logs. We'll just keep going down like a normal person. Woo! Hi, small child. I Er, old man. Definitely child. Hi, Tefra. Hello, astronaut. Are you going into space today? Are you going into space and never coming back like Feldspar did? Don't worry, I'll come back. That's what Feldspar said, too. But they never did. Hornfels, Hornfels will be really sad if you don't come back. Like, how sad it makes them to talk about Feldspar. So you should make sure you don't get lost in space, too. Oh, bye, Tefra. I would have tried not to get lost in space. Fortunately, this is a game, which I think means it's got saving, so that way I probably won't die in space. Okie dokie! Launch codes! Let's go! We don't need to talk to anybody else. We've said our goodbyes. Toodle you. Oh, how neat! Oh, I've got one of those little gravity crystals. I've got some neat computer stuff. I've got a uh, nice map here of the outer wilds. Got my suit. Got a teeny tiny first aid kit. And I've got this beautiful pilot's chair. Oxygen refill. Spot a tree. Walk towards it. Enjoy. <laughs> okay. the hell am I going? And what is that button? The button that says view maps. I'm not totally sure what button that is. Haha! -ha! That is my scope of my jig. Cool. Nope. 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 Stay buckled. That's liftoff. That's landing camera. Ah, whatever. Who cares about the map? Famous last words. Who's that? What is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? That's a harmonica. Which is not the planet I'm looking for. Where is the planet I'm looking for? Hang on. Nope. It's also a harmonica. Alright, that is very close, and... Is that a flute? That's not really a flute. Sure, you know what? Giant Steep, let's go. Engage autopilot. Oh, heck yes. Oh, I'm so very grateful. <laughs> I did not want to be 100% in charge of that. Autopilot complete. So, landing mode? How do I do this? Do I have to not hit the... I have to not hit that, don't I? I 
Am I dead? Am I dead? Where am I? What? I'm gonna guess I can't land in water, so... Up! 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 Okay... This isn't great! Is there land? That looks like a rock! I have landed! Am I done? Can we call that done? Cockpit view. Yes. Great! Put away. Unbuckle. Aha! Open hatch. I feel like that hurt. I feel like I messed something up and caused myself pain. Yeah, I was definitely supposed to not land on... Oh, I'm dead. <clears throat> I wonder if there was a meter somewhere that told me I was dead. No. <gasps> Wait. Did I lose all of that progress? No, because I clearly have the launch codes. How did I... How did I get back here? Didn't I already lift off? Trust me, with the modifications I've made to those rockets, there's no way I would have missed that. I won't ask how you got the launch codes, but since you have them, get a move on. I want to see whether the new cockpit stays attached during liftoff. Okay, so... Something wonkity, fuckity, bizarre is going on here. And I'm thinking that statue's at the center of it. Yeah! Let's go! Let's go find us Giants Deep, shall we? Whoops, nope, wrong one. That one. Engage autopilot. Take me there. I will do better this time. I will remember to put on a suit. <laughs> Tefra, right before I leave, try not to die! Ten seconds after I get to Giants Deep, death! <laughs> Just... Okay, good. You're actually on Giant Steep. I was worried he was on the moon. Okay. And now we know that we just kind of go straight down until we find a safe place to land. Landing mode. Try not to hit all of that space junk. Okay. Go. Let's go find ourselves a landing pad. Preferably not one right next to a gigantic storm. It's telling me where launch or landing spaces are, isn't it? Okay, up, up, up. Eventually we'll find a safe spot. That is not where I landed before, but it has a landing spot. Beach. Woo! Okay. This is much better. 
This looks good. Stuff. Suit. Genius. Health and fuel are full. Is there anything else we need? Yeah, view ship log. I have gone. Village, Zero Kuchi Cave. Neat. Wait, what the heck is rumor mode? Whatever, we'll look at this later. Who cares? And we don't need any of that. We just need to open the hatch and go. Unidentified signal nearby. Would that be somewhere over here? Gosh, this game is really pretty. Hey! You! You person! Nice to see you. Good to see you made it here in one piece. The first solo launch is a doozy, isn't it? Yeah. So hey, don't laugh, but I think I might have, like, just died somehow? Do you remember, you know, dying a few minutes ago? Maybe? Oh yeah, we definitely died. Okay, cool. That's, that's what I thought. It was all way too vivid to be a dream. I tried radioing Hornfells and asking them if they had died too, but they thought I was being metaphorical. Well, if you remember dying, then I guess I didn't just fall asleep and have a bad dream or something. I don't know what's going on, though. Today's been weird. Like, I was on a different island earlier, right? I was on the beach looking at one of those big stone statues of a Nomai head, and the next thing I know, it's looking back at me. Glowing. The statue replays everything I've just done, like it's been watching me through my own eyes, you know? And then suddenly it stops and everything's normal again. That's exactly what happened to me at the observatory. You too, huh? Come to think of it, when I died, I saw what I'm pretty sure were my memories going backward. Just like that time with the statue. Do you think the Nomai statues are related to us dying somehow? Yes. And another thing, we died, but we aren't dead. That's pretty unusual for Harthians. Well... That's what's new with me, but hey, this is your first solo voyage. Let's talk about you, you know? How's space treating you? I just died. <laughs> Where should I explore on Giant's Deep? Well, actually, after waking up from, you know, dying, I saw the same bright flash in the sky. Something must be happening up there in orbit around the planet. What else? What else? Have you been to Statue Island? That's what I've been calling it. Seeing as it's the island where I found the glowing Nomai statue. Get it? I was on the beach on Statue Island and the whole glowy business happened. By the way, it's a nice beach for that kind of thing. I give it a solid 7 out of 10 on the Gabbro relaxation scale. If you feel like checking out Statue Island, it's the one with two islands connected by a natural rock arch. Well, mostly connected anyway. You'll see. How's space treating you? What are you doing out here? Well, what are any of us doing out here, Rally? Oh, God. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just out here exploring our solar system. Same as you. But I'll tell you what. Outer space really gives you room to think. It's so quiet and peaceful out here. I mean, it's usually quiet and peaceful. Sometimes a cyclone comes by and lifts my little island paradise clean out of the water. Then, less peaceful. What's up with this planet? Haha, <laughs> I know, right? Oh, oh, you meant, like, tell you more about it. Ah, I gotcha. Well, Giant's Deep is massive and mostly water. No surprises there. There's a strong current a ways beneath the surface that prevents anything from sinking below it. Seriously, I tried everything I could think of to get past that current, and neither idea worked. <laughs> As for land masses, I've counted four islands, including this one. There's also the one with that Nomai statue I saw on the beach. You've seen the cyclones. Yeah, they're hard to miss. They'll toss up everything in their path, islands included. Little tip, if you get picked up, try to land in water. Less likely to kill you. Where's your ship? That's a good question. It's definitely on this planet somewhere. I mean, unless a cyclone came by and tossed it into space, I guess. <laughs> that would be pretty nuts. I hope it's not lonely. 
Oh my god. Why does it say unidentified signal nearby? Like, I, I know who and what it is. Signal is identified. Okie dokie, let's wander up the beach 7 out of 10 on the Gabber relaxation scale after you had your mind no my invaded. Not cool. I'm very glad that this is that cyclone moving towards me. I think that cyclone might be moving. I don't like that. I don't like that. I'm going to the other side of the island because that's totally going to help. Is this a save point? Is this what a save? No. This is where I can roast a marshmallow. I'm glad I ate or breathed poison gas in order to uh, eat that marshmallow. Oh, something is right on top of me. Oh god, no. Oh no, 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 no. I lived? No. The hell am I? Wait. Wait a second. Nope, 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 nope. No, 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 no. No, 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 Remember that zero degree training. Help! Oh, God! Run, 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 run now. Get under something. Did that cyclone legitimately throw me into space? And Gabbro's just chill. Alright, well, Gabbro's got problems. Ooh, what did I find? Ghost matter detected nearby. No. Um, not signal scope. I want my camera. Not helpful. Okay, fine. But I can't go down there because that will kill me. Staying outside just means I'm going to get sucked up by cyclones, which was absolutely terrifying. But really cool at the same time. Then where can I go? Looks like I can probably go to that Nomai statue then. Did not like the cyclone thing. That was not neat. Although it is nice to know that that's where the fire was and that's where the path ended, so there was nothing to see beyond that. I'm getting too far out onto this point. I'm going to die. Something is going to eat me. I just feel it in my bones. I like the twisty roots of these trees. That's really neat. Ooh. Oh, balls. Okay. Not good. You cannot go down that pathway. No matter how hard you try doesn't matter what direction you're coming from, don't do it. Okay. Put suit back. Buckle up. Let's go find one of these other islands. Why? Why? Why are we doing it like this? Why am I caught in a tree? This is not my fault. This is so unnecessarily challenging! Whatever. We're here. We're here. Done. Unbuckle. Suit. Down. This looks ceremonial. And bizarre. But neat! Let's go down here. I think Gabbro's the actual only person on this planet. So this seems a bit... much. This looks like a cyclone pad. What happens if I step on the cyclone? Okay, nothing hurts me. Alright! Okay... Pretty little bonsai tree. Neat little space. Hang on. No, where is my know my reader? 
I feel like there may be something here to read. No! Shoot, I don't remember what button it was. I feel like there's something here to read. No, I don't remember. No! Ooh, that's glowy. Ooh, that's hella glowy. Oh, this would be a perfect place for one of those crystals that I have. I've got one. Maybe I can go put one in there? I feel bad for anybody who's played this game because they're probably like screaming at their... Haha! Just walk on the damn thing, Kelsey. You'll figure it out. Got there, everybody. Sorry, took me a second. Okay. Where do I want to go from here? Wait, can I go under the water? <gasps> I can! Is there anything cool under here? No! Oh, this is very cool. Oh, oh, this is not good. Oh, no. Yep. You're just all of a sudden in space. I think that's where I came from. Oh, cheapa doopa da! Ow! I do believe I was supposed to land in water right there. I think that's how that's supposed to go. So is this just a series of how far can you go before you die in space? This is not going to be fun, everybody. I'm going... I historically die a lot. Huh. Neat! Alright, well. Am I going to have the same conversation every time? No, okay. Just that first time. So I can always come back here if I need more stuff. What's the consequence of dying then? Just you have to go and get back out to wherever you're headed? Because, I mean, that it's true that's not super convenient. On the yoba doop! Please fly away from the planet. I mean, I want to learn more about Giant's Deep because that was really neat. Ooh! Anybody else see the planet that I'm trying to leave suddenly rise up and nearly claim me? Oh, good! Autopilot will just take that over so I don't have to die. <laughs> oh, some people are talented in the ways of space travel. I am not. Oh, wait, if I keep that on, will it be easier to find him? Probably. But I don't need to find him, so who cares? Because once I get down here, I'm going to go back to where I was, because that was neat. Yeah, that spacecraft definitely... Down thrust. Wow. Wow! Okay. On the plus side, hitting water doesn't kill me. I'm very grateful for that. But now we've got to go find where we left off. Which was right there. Hey! Success. Yes! Haha! -ha. Cockpit view. Leave. Actually, I really like the flight controls. Sometimes flight controls are just insane. These are- oh no, oh no, oh no, get back in the thingy, get back in the thingy. I need my suit, or I will die. Use your brain, learn lessons. That was the whole point of the first flight. 
Guys, I'm not stupid, I'm scatterbrained. I get excited and distracted, and then I just run off and leave valuable things behind, like oxygen. Okay, so scamper we go. And we are gonna go find out... There's got to be something else to look at here. We gotta get there kinda quickly. Yay. Okay. Made it. Brilliant. Pick up control module projection stone. Hello? Insert control module projection stone. What did that just- hello? I have bad news, Avens. Yarrow says there was a problem with the proposed power source, so the orbital probe cannon won't be asked to fire. Avens, I hope you're pulling my locomotive limb here, Ka Cassava. <laughs> Cassava, tell Privet and Mallow they should return from the cannon. My spouse and I will remain at the construction yard for now. An update. Mallow and I will join you and Daz. Privet just left to visit her brother. She fears Idea... Idea? Idea? May feel responsible. Okay. I wish I were, my friend, but no. They aren't certain they can fix the problem, so their orbital probe cannon is on infinite hiatus. Okay, so. Problem with power source, so the power source, so the orbital probe cannon won't be asked to fire. You must be joking. I'm not joking. Tell people to return to the cabin or to the cannon. We're gonna stay at the construction yard. We'll join you. Some people feel responsible. Four minutes and seven seconds ago, long-range probe successfully launched from orbital probe cannon. Is this a recording of the their like successful launch? Oh, kitty, no! Oh no! Oh, I'm gonna die! I didn't die, but I'm gonna die. How do I make sure that I land in water? Do I go where water normally is? Water's normally down here. When you put me back down, can I be here? In water? Oh no. Yes! Figured it out, everybody. Lived, did fine. Okay, so that's why you have a couple seconds up there, is just to, like, help you figure out how to get to water. Also super valuable to know that if I need... Can I go pick up that key again, or is that key... Yes. Remove that from the true projection stone, put it over here. Okie dokie. So... Yeah, what just happened? I am made of liquid! Shit is really weird! What is happening?! Oh, can we stop this? I don't like this. What the fuck is this game? Every time I'm like, oh, this is how stuff works. Uh, shit goes off the rails. <laughs> the fricky, frickity big bag balls was that? Okay, so I am holding a projection stone and it looks like that symbol goes in there, the one with two goes over there, and the one with three goes over there. And I'm standing around a circle, so my guess is there are three of these that I need to drop off. So maybe I just have to find them and place them in places. Oh. I don't want to leave that there. I'm going to leave that there. Okay. I have left it. It's doing whatever the diddly dung it's doing. 
We're... I'll go to the other side. I love that they get to play with, like, how much they play with gravity so far in the game. Not only do you have zero G and you have to figure out how to navigate in that, which I was not very good at, but also they've got this cool rock thing that glows and then you get to go all over the place. And then you have just random stuff that will throw you into space just for giggles. That's a cyclone right there. Are you coming for us? Is that what you're doing right now? Please don't be coming for us. I, I am trying to make progress. And you will get in my way. I can feel it. Oh, that is so scary. Can you imagine seeing that in real life? You would probably shit yourself. I would shit myself. It wouldn't be good. That would be so terrifying. Three minutes of oxygen remaining before I what? I have to return to my ship? That matches... Dang it! <laughs> that matches absolutely none of the symbols that the other thing showed me. So what do I do about that? There's nowhere under here to take it. Okay. Let's head back, drop it off, see what happens. This one looks like a crapped, cra crapped, whoops, cracked globe. Which is kind of neat. Alright. Do you have anything to add? Yes! Haha! -ha! Okay, so I get new things. Conoy, Daz, and I were lifting orbital probe cannon components into orbit for assembly, and one somehow sank down beneath the current. Okay. Kasava convinced me not to try to recreate the phenomenon myself using the other cannon parts, but we're very curious to know what happened. How could something pass through the current? Okay, so they also couldn't get through the current. My gratitude for your interesting question. This is exciting. Spire constructed a model of Giant's Deep here at the Brittle Hollow's Southern Observatory, and it reveals how an object might sink below the current. Conoy, I'm unable to grasp the answer by looking through the projection pool. If I visit the observatory, would you the uh, observatory? The observatory, would you kindly explain? If you don't mind the trek beneath the surface to the South Pole, I'd be delighted to see you. The trailhead starts at the Brittle Hollow's equator. Conway, you should have seen it. We we'd thought it was impossible for any cannon components to sink even partially below the current, but ours sank straight to the core. Aha! So... Neat. So... gonna freak me out! Okay, so this allows me to see the other observatory. And that's what I'm looking at here. And there's clearly a projection stone over there. Oh no. Oh no. Am I about to die? Is that what's happening? No, I'm in space. I need to get where there's water. I'm gonna die if I don't hurry my ass up! Water, 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 water! We're good. We're safe, we're fine. We do, however, very much need to get back to the ship. Like, right the F now. Because I have almost no oxygen. Oh! Really? Literally, just walk near a tree and your oxygen refills. Okay, I didn't think it was that easy. All right. Neat. Now, is there anywhere over up here to drop any of these? Hello. Wait, is this a? Pr I just missed this. I. Ch uh. Let's go stick the thing in the thing. Let's read the stuff. 
This is it. We've finished building the final orbital probe cannon module and are ready to send it into orbit around Giant's Deep for assembly. To all my friends here at the construction yard, my gratitude for your tireless work. I had given up hope, but I truly believe this cannon may actually succeed where many other attempts have not. Daz, if I know my brother at Avens and his spouse will want to launch the probe with as much power as possible, I'm worried the cannon would break under the strain. I propose we give Avens and Mallow a slightly lower maximum power setting than the absolute maximum possible to create room for their enthusiasm. <laughs> Are you going gelatinous on us, love? I'm delighted by your words, but they're atypical for you. If I'm ever half as gooey as Mallow and Avens behave together, Daz, you may launch me from the orbital probe cannon. <laughs> ah, yes, because being gooey in love makes you gross, no matter what your species is. Our next step will be to send Private up to, up to the orbital probe cannon to install the probe tracking system. Okay, so now I need to, like, reverse engineer all the things that I've just learned in my head. So, we've got a probe cannon launcher. We've got a couple of observatories. We've got stuff that can make it through. Just, you have to be through the current at the bottom of the planet. Sorry, I'm middle of thought and just abandoned it. So we have a place that you actually can make it through that bottom current, but you have to go to the right location to do that, which I believe is the southern ob south, south Pole Observation, which is under the water. So we're going to have to go underwater. Maybe not immediately. We might want to check out the other islands first, just in case there's anything else going on. But I think I found everything that I needed to find here. And that was really cool. This game just keeps throwing me for a loop, and I'm absolutely loving it. So... Let's jump in and buckle in and let's head to the next place. Guys, thank you so much for watching this particular filler episode. Thank you for watching this. I'm loving playing this. So unless you specifically tell me in the comments that you hate it, <laughs> I'm going to keep going. And I would love any recommendations that you have. If I missed something, as you can see, dying just drops me back off at the original planet. So if I miss something, please feel free to tell me. Kelsey, go back and do the thing! No spoilers, obviously, but I, I will take gentle suggestions to make sure that I don't miss anything super valuable. And we will see you in next week's class of Dead Funny University. Bye, friends!